This is Twin Cities Adventures and we are with our Minnesota Chickens playlist. And today, we're gonna make snack trays for the chickens. See, there's one sitting there just collecting dust. I'm just brush that off here. Put it to better use. So it's a rainy day today and just to get creative, the chickens wanna go outside and they probably wanna run around in the rain, but I thought I'd give them something fun. And we're building snack trays up on the roosting bars. See, I just put a couple of zip ties, screwed a couple holes in, mount that to the hardware cloth, and I put one screw into the wood here. So now we've got a snack tray up high on the roosting bar there. No worries about rain getting in there because there's an overhang up there on the ceiling. And let's see, I think I'll put another one up here mount that to that side there. That way it'll give them something to do. It'll have them, get them to climb up on their roosting bars and snack around. Or maybe I should put it on this side over here. Maybe, no, that's where they climb, hop from there to there. So yeah, I think I'll mount that one over here. That way it'll give them kind of like an obstacle course. Chickens like to be entertained. Right now they're just kind of getting done with their dirt bath for the day and they're balking at me because they want to go hunting. I'll let them go run around in the rain for a little bit out there today, just for the fun of it. Well, let's get busy mounting this one up here and we'll screw the holes through there and we can zip tie that. Okay, here's what it looks like from the outside. One there and one up there. Let's go inside and see who wants some treats up there. Who wants some treats? Buck, 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 buck. Who wants some treats? Buck, 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 buck. Everybody wants treats. <laughs> Let's go in here. Here we have a mixture of, here's some mealworms and chicken scratch and oyster shells. Here we have a mixture in this old coffee can. Who wants some treats? Buck, 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 buck. Here we go. Put a bunch in there and a bunch in there. There you go. Buck, 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 buck. See if you can find it. Looky there. <laughs> Nightmare is the first one to find the new treat buckets. Looky there, you found them. I feel like I'm gonna have to build some ladders, like chutes and ladders, to get to all these stations for the chickens now. There we go, all chickens on deck. After snack time, if you want, I'll take you outside in the rain. You guys want to go walking around looking for uh, worms in the rain? Oh yeah, they're having fun. Okay, shoots and ladders begins now. Here is one little walkway up to that treat bucket. I'm just gonna have to cut some tree branches down and screw them in here for good traction. And I think this other one here, I'll probably mount it somewhere over here. I'll take a look at that in a second. Okay, I've got two ladders here, one there, and one there. And now I have a pile of sticks here that I cut for steps. Let's get those mounted on. There you go. So how do you like that? I just put three screws in each stick here. And I like these foot holdings to be close together because their feet are small. Here goes, come on over here. Try this out. There you go. <laughs> Here's some more treats. Here we go. 
Cheats. Cheats. Look you there. Good job, sunflower. Okay, we just shifted them below the surface of the bar, so that way more chickens can eat at once. And I put a couple of drain holes in them too, small holes, just in case any moisture gets in there, it'll drain. A couple chickens over there. The biggest girl right here just monopolizes the bottom one. And that's screwed into the wood frame here and zip tied to the hardware cloth. Now, I warned these guys, you guys better not be laying eggs in here because I, I wouldn't be surprised if they did. Yeah. And it's a nice bowl for them. Here is the view from the outside. See it's screwed right in there to the perch and then zip tied right there. Nice and flush. That is really solid. Even the largest of chicken would be able to fit on in there. Not And now the chickens have been really bugging me to go outside and play around in the rain and look for worms. So let's take them outside and let them root around in the rain and see what happens. Just a little. 